who he didn't take the field at his pro day. She talked to him. He seems confident. He knows the next month's going to change his life. He went as far as tweeting that yesterday. He's going to be a dad for the first time yeah. before the draft. So yeah. if he had participated, would that have helped him at all? I don't think so. Uh, I think the only thing that could have happened is he could have heard his draft stock because, again, like we said, he already crushed the combine in Indy, and that's really where you want to, you know, have your best your best uh, testing uh, is in Indy, um, where all the gyms, all the coaches, all the owners, everybody's going to be there. Mm. Um, so the only thing that that can happen for Saquon at this point is is him his draft stop going down by going out there to his pro day at Penn State and and maybe not running as fast or maybe not lifting as many reps in the bench test or maybe not jumping as high or, or dropping a few balls in the past when he's catching passes from the quarterback. So I like the fact that he didn't uh, do the combine uh, at, at Penn State because, again, he's already, he's already said that you know, his actions have spoken very loudly uh, from the Indy combine. Would you work out for any team at this point, or would you just put drop the mic and no. say, you know what, you, you would be done? Drop put it on mic. ice. Drop the mic, because the, the tape Brown, doesn't Brown's lie. call and say, you know what, we have the first and fourth. We just want one last look at you. Would you say yeah. no? I would say no, because listen, at the end of the day, and this is what kind of irritates me sometimes, is mm -hmm. we put too much on the combine testing, because at the end of the day, the tape, the game footage does not lie. It, the, the game footage is going to show who you truly are. The combine testing, that's like the, the cherry on the top. You know, that's like the, the ice on top of the Sunday. So um, I don't think it, he's, he's fine. And we all, I'm all in on him. But I think everybody else is all in on him. And I've seen you at the podium. I want to meet you. I want to yeah. look you in the eye. I'm, I'm sure they've already met my him. entire franchise in yeah. you. I want to sit down for that last look. Yeah. I don't know if I'd say no. I think I'd probably go. It's different to meet with them. It's different to work out for them. Okay. Yeah. I think that's when you heard it. You know, yeah. listen. Can they call him straight up on the phone right now, Shrakes? And yeah. say, can we yeah. Uh, yeah. have a Let's schedule a visit? Okay. They, they can. Yeah, what's up? It's the Browns. You want to talk? Sure. We're going to talk. And then we can talk about not only how I worked out at the combine, how I had an awesome workout at the combine. I look at it like, you ever watch Jeopardy and they get to Final Jeopardy and the guy who's the champion has a $10,000 lead and you don't wager more than 10000 because then you can get caught. Right. You wager eight. Yeah. If Saquon shows up and works out and does all that, he's wagering more than 10000 and can get burnt. He, he's going to win. Yeah. He's got it. I think it's done. I, I'd step off. There's also this yeah. freak thing. Remember Sidney Jones last year at his pro day yeah. hurt himself and then obviously Fabian Moreau, the cornerback, mm -hmm. tore a peck trying to do the mm -hmm. bench, trying mm -hmm. to show. Yeah. There is that freak possibility that yes. Saquon Barkley goes out there to run a 40 and tears his hamstring. Yes. Like, True. Yeah. Put it on ice. Yeah. Love that. More on Saquon Barkley. More on Sam Darnold, who decided to not throw at the Combine. Mm -hmm. So he has the USC Pro Day hours from now at USC. And we have everything you need before your team's on the clock, breaking down which college stars will shine on Sundays. We've got in-depth analysis that you can't get anywhere else, all leading up to draft day. It's Path to the Draft tonight at 6 p.m. Eastern and only right here on NFL Network. All right, we're having a blast here at NFL